Bros, Super Reaction Bros. I'm Chris. And I'm Christopher. And on today's episode, we're taking a look at the new History Channel. This is the new this History is Channel TV, TV series, series, Nightfall. Yeah. Executive produced by Jeremy Renner. Oh shit, really? Yeah, that's why I found out when looking up Wikipedia. <laughs> and if you haven't guessed, um, this is about the Knights Templar. Yeah. Not those Knights Templar for those who play Assassin's Creed, but the actual original Knights the Templar. The original Knights Templar and during their reign. Pretty yeah, much. pretty much. I mean, in the early... channel has been doing great on the C T TV series so far. I mean, Vikings I heard has been doing phenomenally well. Yeah. The story wise, so hopefully, you know, I'm, I'm hoping this one stays, you know, just as strong as uh as the uh, the Vikings. Well, I don't watch Vikings, but I may watch this one at least from like what I'm hearing about it. So, mm -hmm. um. I, you know, like he said, pretty much, it's like they're how they pretty much manage to protect a lot of religious things, pretty much, for the Knights of the Templar. Pretty much, they defended and pretty much fought in honor of God and things like that. Yeah. So, I mean, I know there's more to them than just that, but you know, maybe, and that's what the series is probably gonna dive into. Where that's what I love about the History Channel, they, they dive into actual things that may have happened or closely may have happened, pretty yeah. much. So, let's check it out. Let's dive right into this for the official trailer for nightfall. There's a second trailer, supposedly. That's fine. Andre de Luton, you're short. Where were you first prepared to lead the temple? In my heart. And where was that heart tested? In the field of battle. By the grace of God, rise, master of the temple. Rise, master of the temple. And find us the grail. The grail. Yeah, that's what was always the girl. I should not be master, and I am not worthy to find the grail. And raise not the temple they think he is. There is an army on French somewhere, loyal not to you, but to the Pope. This is defiance by God, Landry, I cannot allow it. Oh, it's an 80s show. Oh, it is. Never mind. Okay, that's our bad. The Holy Grail is in France. What better symbol to lead us back to the Holy Land? The Pope must be dealt with, and we must recover the Grail for ourselves. This <coughs> temple is not safe for you or the Grail. This will be the death of you. The armies of God will be reborn. What does this mean, my lord? It means war. I have given my life to the grail. What kind of queen would I be if I did not defend my people? The ones we love the most are the ones most likely to betray us. It's history channel. So, wait, so it's by, produced by Annie, but it is coming yeah. in history channel. Okay, so overall, that looks like if you need that Game of Thrones Vikings fix while they're like you're between seasons on both shows. That's what it is. It, it looks like, like that fix. Just, just like how pretty much, you know, with Game of Thrones gone just for, you know, on hiatus for at least for another two years, it's like we have Westworld to fill in its Kay. gap pretty much, you oh, know? Should we gotta watch Westworld. Yeah. Um, <laughs> be perfectly honest. You saw an assassin in there, I and thought, you went... The assassins. The assassins. assassins! Oh, shit! It's the real! The enemy is real! Ah! ah uh, sorry. Uh, it looks interesting. It so, it's works. essentially this guy's quest. He is, he is leading an army to find the Holy Grail. That is his goal yeah. in life as and a knight's temple. As a knight's, and, and, and they're dealing with a lot with another army who also wants that power, pretty much. Who also was looking for the Grail. And, of course... Intrigue, seduction, you know, your normal Game of Thrones stuff. Yeah, your normal type of stuff you would see in, you know, during this time period or even in a show like, you know, a show like this pretty much where it's a timepiece where it's like there's always some type of manipulation somewhere. Yeah, so I mean, I think one thing I've heard what's good about the Viking series, since it is on History Channel, is it's actually fairly accurate to the you know history of the Vikings and yeah, stuff. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure so, here they're going to stick with the accuracy of how 
the Knights Templar actually were. You know how they yeah. how they moved, how they worked, their inner workings of everything. And where did the Holy Grail ultimately ultimately lead them? Yeah, exactly. I mean, well, you know, hopefully they give us a description of why they start hunting for the Holy Grail. You know, a specific reason. And hopefully they don't choose poorly. Yeah, <laughs> don't choose poorly. <laughs> so. Other than that, though, if you're new to the channel, hit the like button. If you want to talk some more about stuff like this, comment down below. If you want to share this around, share it around. And if you feel like it's just a little bit more than anybody else when it comes to making Assassin's Creed references, hit the subscribe button down below. And if you're on mobile, also hit the little bell on the right. Um, again, so that's what you think. Uh, if you love Vikings or you even love watching these historical shows where some of them are based on actual either events or anything like that, definitely comment down below. Let us know what you think and what you... What's your hopes for for this type of show or the premise behind this you know so let us know in the comments below yeah so until next time i'm chris and i'm christopher and that was a very templar filled episode of srb see ya later hey guys thanks for watching yeah and if you want to see any more of our videos check out the playlist links down below in the description and you can also check out our twitter uh, account pretty much uh, down below at super react bros